Okay, here we go. Here we go. You guys gonna help me vacuum? We're vacuuming Dad's office. Ready? Here we go. Says, can you sing me a song, please? Another song, Avery? Yep, another one. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, I need to do it again. Sing her a song. A different song? Yeah. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Knees and toes. It likes Freddy Cool. Pillows. Show us knees and toes. Knees and toes. Oh, she likes that one. It likes Freddy Cool. It does look pretty cool. Can you sing her another one, Grace? She's crying. We're doing bath time right now, trying to entertain Avery. Porter's still in the bathtub. He won't get out. Grayson's already in his jammies. I forgot to tell you guys the funniest thing that happened at the pediatrician appointment. I can't believe I forgot about it. So the doctor was like chucking Grayson out. And then towards the end, he turned to Grayson and he was like, do you have any questions for me? And Grayson was like, yes. And then he was like, okay, what's your question? And then Grayson thought for a while. And then he said, he turned to the doctor and he said, what makes you fart? We are in a farting, tooting, whatever phase right now. He loves it. He mostly does it when my sister Allison is over. But yeah, he asked him that. And the doctor was actually like thrilled about the question. He was like, that's a great question. Let me tell you about it. So he explained the whole process and we get gas in our bodies and we have to break it down I see, I see. and how it has to exit our bodies. And there's only two ways it can come out, either through a burp or a fart. And I was just over in the corner slightly dying because my five-year-old is talking about farts and embarrassing me so I bet your day went better than mine because yeah that happened I was just like Grayson for real I mean at least it was a medical question I guess but uh, yeah that was my day today so has your kid ever asked a professional an embarrassing question write it down below i would love to see some of these because kids say the funniest things so definitely yeah that that i will never forget that for sure hi Avery. <laughs> hi oh are you gonna talk okay one second hi are you talking? Oh, are you so happy today? Hi. I'm a happy girl. I'm a happy girl. Yeah. I'm so happy. Come on in. I tell the word. Say hi, friends. Welcome to the vlog. Hello. You guys, she is so happy every morning. Bless you. Bless you. She just is always smiling and cooing in the morning. And then the rest of the day, she kind of is like, yeah, not as into it. But I can always catch her in such a good mood in the mornings. Yeah. Today is the first day of June. Can you believe it? I feel like this year is just flying by. It is officially my birthday month. My birthday is in nine days. I can't even wrap my head around that. This is like the last couple days of my 20s. I'm going to be 30. Oh, I just don't even want to be 30. Um, Anthony says he's got some sort of surprise for me for my 30th birthday. Although it's not really a surprise because I know something's happening. I just don't know exactly what it is he's planning. So stay tuned for that because that'll be interesting. But today is June 1st. And today I go back to the doctor. I went yesterday and took Grayson to his five-year well check appointment. And today I have Avery's two-month-old appointment. So we are getting ready and then we are going to go. I'm going to take Porter with me and we are going to go to the doctor. 
and we'll get updated stats on Avery and see how big she's gotten. She's really chunked up, so I'm curious to see. I'm I'm going to bet she's in the mid nines, if not like the high nines, so we will see. Nine pounds, five ounces, nine pounds, eight ounces, 15 ounces, who knows? We're going to find out. And we'll see if she's grown any in length because ever ever since she's been born, she's been 21 and a half inches. So eventually she's got to get taller. We'll see if today's the day that she's grown. So we will see. I will keep you updated on that. But say hi. I love the attention. And she's so happy. See, I'm finding my boys. Hi. Hi, baby. Oh, hi. <laughs> she is kicking up a storm. Yeah, you kick, 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 kick. Yes, you are. <laughs> yeah. You're at the doctor. Oh, it's okay. She's like, I remember this place. I want to know you. Exact same room <laughs> as yesterday. <laughs> And I've got Porter with me. Say hi, Port. Hi. Let's see. She's 10 pounds, 22 inches. You're so big. You're so big. We're just waiting to see the doctor. Having fun. What do you think, Avery? This is so much fun. So my mom went and got Avery this play mat that's all over TikTok. They say the songs get stuck in your head and I guess Baby's really like interacting with it. Avery's a little young, but the boys, watch your, watch your knee, don't hit Avery. But the boys are obsessed with the toy. I think they might enjoy it more than she does. But I definitely think she'll get more into it. It's cute. Like, they kick it and it interacts. And then, of course, there's toys. And then there's a little mirror right here where she can see herself. And so. a piano and books and this. So fun. And Avery and this work. So we are back from Avery's appointment, obviously. It went really well. I told the doctor that she's not taking bottles. That was my only complaint. He said to try Dr. Brown bottles, so I guess I can try that. He didn't really have any good suggestions, which I didn't really expect anything. I think I'm just gonna have to keep trying, keep exposing her to the bottle. And he was like, when do you go back to work? Like, when do you need to get her on bottles? And I was like, well, I don't go back to work. I just want freedom from her for an hour or so. And he was like, oh. <laughs> So, okay, hang on. You can have a turn in a second. Porter wants a turn on the toy. So, anyway, other than that, the appointment went really well. She's 10 pounds now, you guys. I thought for sure she would be like middle nines. No, she's middle 10. She was like 10 pounds, 8 ounces. Like, what? And then she's finally grown. She's 22 inches tall. So, she's finally grown a little bit. And other than that, it went really well. She got two shots and then a drink of something. Did fine. Hated the shots, of course. But other than that, he said she's looking really, really good. Saw her lifting her head up, although she was not happy to do tummy time because I already did it with her this morning. I talked about how her head, like her forehead looks like mega mind a little. It's just like very bulgy. But he said it's fine. Her plates are just taking a bit longer to like move around and get in place. But not too big of a deal. But other than that, it went really well. And now she doesn't go back until four months old. So in August. So after we do the cruise, then I will take her to her next appointment. But other than that, he said she's doing really well. Just told me um, she's going to start reaching and grabbing for things. Um, stuff like that. He said to try to keep her out of the heat and the sun. No sunscreen till she turns six months old. So just keep her in the shade. Which I don't usually take her out that much anyway. Porter came with me. He did okay. He kept playing with his cars. And they kept like rolling all around the ground. I was trying to pay attention to the doctor. But Porter was like being crazy. But other than that, it was fine. And yeah, it was a good appointment. So... I think I'm going to take Avery. I think she wants to eat. And then I think the boys want to turn playing with this toy. So, yeah, I'll move her so they can have a turn.